were approached by the Croatian police boat on the border of Croatia and Montenegro, and they've asked us to follow them, which is weird. I don't know why they just didn't want to see our papers here. Um, so, posting this because if something happens to us, at least this was on Facebook, our time is 9.33 local time. Coordinates 42, well here's our coordinates. And we're following them to this bay, which is, I don't know, a bit strange. All right, we will update after we're through this experience. So for those of you sailing Croatia, you need to leave immediately after checking out. Not as the guidebook says, you need to check out and leave. Fortunately, I had the guidebook showing that the Harbor Master's office was only open Monday through Saturday lunchtime and that it was not possible to check out on a Sunday. So we checked out yesterday right before lunchtime and then we departed this morning. Well, the police pulled us over because they said you checked out yesterday. Why are you leaving now? You're late. It's a 1,000 to 5,000 kuna fine, and they were giving us the minimum, they said, which would have been about $100 US. And then if we paid the only credit card, it would be 600 kuna. It would be about $85, $90 kuna. Yeah. I was not having that. I brought the book out. I showed proof. We were polite. We said, hey, we're following the rules. This is what it says. Their response was that is not an official guide. You need to talk to the harbor master to get the official word on where to check out and when. And so they were ready to take our money with our, you know, right there on board. And finally, they called the boss back at the harbor master's office and we were let go with just a warning. They said, okay, we're gonna take a picture of the book to prove that you were following the rules. They did, they checked our passports, they checked our boat docks. But what an, a bitter taste of visiting Croatia. I don't think we'll be back. In fact, I know we will not go back. It was awkward, very awkward. Yeah, the kids were all on deck with Sunny and they were all right, but. Well, they were nice enough, but it's like, I don't know, that you have sour taste in your mouth when you're trying to follow the rules and they just want to take your money. Exactly. So we felt like a lot of the time in Croatia, it was, you had to pay for everything. And if it was a national park, we totally agree with that because we are all for saving. Yeah, exactly. However, <clears throat> thankfully we had that free map to um, all the free anchorages because everywhere you have to pay for a buoy or pay to anchor, unless you have the map of the, uh, of the free spots that aren't as, touristy, which is fine by us, we don't want to be by the tourist areas, but it was, yeah, not the best experience this morning, and we were happy to go south and get into different countries. Ready so, to take our Croatian flag down? Yes, <laughs> we're out of this country. <laughs> Goodbye.